Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna show you the deck the Tech Guinness Monsters or the TG Monsters in TCG. Now if you're wondering what are these monsters, they are the Monsters of Bruno from Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds. He is one of the remaining men in the future of Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds which is Bruno who joined Team 5Ds as their coordinator in the tournament but then it was revealed that he is a villain but he still taught you say how to use the clear mind which summons the infamous shooting star dragon and then the infamous shooting quasar dragon in the final episode now if you're wondering why am i speaking in english well for the other watcher from other country so they can understand what I am saying now a shout out to my best friend uh, Gabe Ruiz Bondock this is his deck and to Jolene one of my fans hi Jolene and now we will start the deck recipe of my tech Guinness deck first of all as you can see this is the tech Guinness cyber magician I have three in my deck. The effect of this monster is unique. Usually, in general rule, you will synchro summon Tech Guinness monster with other monsters in the field. But in this effect, you can special summon a synchro monster with a monster from your hand. Usually, it is partnered with Tech Guinness Rush Rhino. 4 plus 1 equals 5 to summon an synchro, uh, a synchro monster. So I have three. Next, Tech Guinness Striker. Its effect is just like Cyber Dragon. You can special summon this monster from your hand if you don't have any monster in your field and your opponent has. Now, there is another combo, a monster for this monster and it, it will be next. Next is three TG Werewolf or Warwolf. Now if you have a monster that is special summoned to your field, you can special summon this monster that follows that monster. So if you summon Tech Guinness Striker, you can special summon this Warwolf, and you can secret summon level 5. So they are combo. Next, 3 TG Rush Rhino, the partner for TG Cyber Magician. Now this monster's effect is just only simple. When this monster attacks, it gains 400 attack. So its attack is 1,600, it becomes 2000 <clears throat> now this nine and these 12 monsters in my deck has a effect of TG if they are sent to the graveyard from the field if they can if they get destroyed then you will add a TG monster other with another with another name rather than the monster that is destroyed during the end phase to add it to your hand next 1 TG Catapult Dragon. Its effect allows you to special summon a level 3 or lower TG monster from your hand. And 1 Cyber a TG Jet Falcon. Now, if you use this monster as a synchro material, it will deal 500 damage to your opponent. These are the two partners. I only put one each because it doesn't have the effect of the other TGs, which adds another TG monster from your deck to your hand. Next, the non-TG monsters, I have two, Effect Baylor, a staple monster that if your opponent uses an effect, you can discard this card and negate that effect. And it's a level 1 tuner. Next, one, King Cabio, a spirit monster that allows you to, when you normal summon this monster, you can spare summon one level 1 monster from your graveyard. So you can either summon Effect Baylor or TG Cyber Magician if they are in the graveyard already. Then you can synchro summon a level 2 monster. We will see that level 2 monster later. Next, one Black Cluster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning, and a Chaos Sorcerer. Now these monsters are like alike. You just have to banish one light and one dark monster from your graveyard, and then you can special summon them. Then they have a, an effect that you can banish. But if you banish, these monsters can attack. 
Now, Blackwater Soldier has an extra effect. If it destroys a monster, it can it, it can attack again during that turn. Now, for the spell cards, I have two Dark Hole. You can put three, but I only put two in this deck so I can have more spell cards to, so that I can use. Now, the effect of Dark Hole you can destroy all monsters on the field. So, even if you have the TGs that have the effect to add in your hand, much better because if they get destroyed, then you can add, but your opponent cannot add. Well, except if he has a TG monster as well. One reinforcement of the army. This is for the TG striker because the TG striker is a warrior type. Then one, one for one. Now it can be used to spend summon a level one monster from your deck. Although we have five level one monsters. That can be special summon. That's our Cyber Magician and the Effect Veilers. One, Monster Reborn. Now, Monster Reborn is a staple card for, from Yu Gi Oh! series. Can always be seen a lot of times. One, Fire Formation Tanky. Now, it's a, it's a spell card that is being used on Fire Fist monsters, but we can use it to TG Warwolf because. TG Warwolf is a Beast Warrior monster. 1 TGX HL. TGX THL. Now, this month, this card, a TGX 1 HL. Now, this card, it lets you have the attack and defense of one TG monster, and then you can destroy a spell or trap card on the field. Now, if, you can, if you're gonna use that monster to sync or summon, then before you sync or summon, you can have the attack and then you can destroy a spell or trap card on the opponent's field. Then the 2 TGX 300. Now this is a good card in TG monsters. Your monsters gain 300 attack for each TG monster in the field. So if you have 5 TG monsters, then your monsters will gain 1,500 each of them. So that was going to be a great deal of damage to your opponent. Now, 3 Mystical Space Typhoon, the MST. So we don't want back rows for opponent. So you let, with TGX, TGX 1E HL, it, like, it looks like you have 4, right? Now for the trap cards, 2 TGX 3 DX2. This effect is like the Pot of Avarice, but you only need 3 monsters. But not just 3 monsters, it should be TG monsters. Then you can shuffle the deck and then draw two cards. Two TG1 EM1. Now the effect of this is you select one monster from your opponent and one face-up TG monster and you switch control of them. So if you have a weak TG monster like Cyber Magician or TG Striker, you can give that monster to your opponent and you will get his powerful monster. Then you can destroy that TG monster and the effect during the end phase you can add another TG monster to your hand. One reinforced truth. This is also for the TG striker. You can special summon a level two or lower warrior type monster. So TG striker is a warrior type, so you can add it. So I prefer to use it on the opponent's end phase. Then three torrential tributes. Just like the dark hole, it destroys all monsters on the field when a monster is being summoned. <clears throat> so it's only good for. It. So it's only it's so it's okay for TG monsters because if they have the effect to add. Once again, add to your hand, then you you still have your advantage, and your opponent loses a, mo loses a monster or his monsters. And one call of the hunted. Usually, we can get we can have three of these in the deck. It's a good ma uh, card because if your opponent activates a MST or a Dustornado to destroy this card, you can chain this card, and you revive a TG monster that can add a mo uh, another TG from your deck to your hand during end phase. So you just chained it, summon the monster, then the call of the hunter will be destroyed by the MST or the Dustornado, and then you can add a TG monster during end phase. So it's a win-win situation for you. And that's the main deck. Now for our extra deck, we have a TG Blade Blaster, TG, TG Power Gladiator, and two TG Wonder Magician. Now I have TG Hyper Librarian here, I just use it on another deck, so that is also included in this extra deck. So that makes 5 TGs. 
There are other TG monsters, but I prefer to use these five. Now TG Wonder Magician lets you destroy a spell or trap card. Power Gladiator is a pierce, piercing damage type monster. And TG Blade Blaster is a high attack monster that is being is uh like a the, the shooting star drag. Now other synchro monsters. Stardust Dragon. Shooting Star Dragon. Formula Synchron. Scrap Dragon. Mistbird Clausalas. Avenging Knight Parset. Actually that's not a real name, it's a fake. It's his real name is the Gauntlet that equips the monster. I usually use this to equip to Black Cluster Soldier so he can have a powerful attack. Then he gets an effect, an extra effect, which is like a, the Flame Wingman effect. That when that monster destroys a monster, it will deal damage to your opponent equals to the attack. I just forgot that name, the Gauntlet. Then one shooting Quasar Dragon, that, that's the ultimate dragon in 5 piece. And then the favorite card of my best friend, Trishula, Dragon of the Ice Barrier, which he calls the s Dead Dragon, because s Dead is ice, and this is ice, and that's the story to the back of it, that's why he calls it the s Dead Dragon. Then I also have Katastor in this deck, the monster that destroys a non-dark monster when it barrels. It just borrowed it to another deck. Now that's my Tech Guinness deck. So yeah, Gabe told one of my videos that this deck can beat that deck. Well, you can be the judge. And this is the TG deck if you want to copy it or make it OCG. So you can use it to tournaments Then that's for you. But if you don't have the other cards, you can always improvise. Use economics for what you have. So thank you for watching my videos. Please like and subscribe. And wait for more videos to come. Thank you. Bye-bye.